built in three games, Arizona State, USC, and Air Force. You know, how, how do you forget this game and move on to Pitt? Uh, it's easy, you know, 24 hours to celebrate this, you know, go out, get Ruth Chris tonight, <laughs> eat a steak or something, and uh, really just watch film, and we got to get back at it on Monday, and, um, you know, obviously look at our mistakes, see how we can get better, and then it's back to regular football. How do you, I guess, do you feel maybe more stress or pressure seeing, as linebackers, seeing so many guys go down in front of you? I mean, do you feel like you guys are kind of the backbone of the defense right now? Um... I'm not, I'm not sure. I don't know if I can really answer that in a way, but I know that, you know, as linebackers, you know, we have a lot to do. You know, one play we have to be in pass coverage. The next play we have to go against, you know, a 300-pound guy. So it's very challenging, but um, we're asked to do it, and we love doing it. How would you describe just kind of being thrust into all this as a freshman? I mean, you didn't have last year. You didn't have what a lot of the other linebackers had underneath you coming into it. Just how would you characterize everything so far? Um, uh, blessing. You know, uh, giving all glory to God and uh, really just having Danny Spahn there to, to help me. You know, he, he knows position better than anybody. And um, just teaching me, you know, making sure I'm on my key and, and know what I'm doing. Um, it's, it's great. Did you ever say anything to Ben when you saw him go down? Um, just a prayer. Yeah, just um, Ben, he's a, he's a dog with me. Um, he didn't play the position that I played this week, but um, yeah, it's going to be it's gonna be um, a great challenge, you know, to to just rally together. Thank you. Thank you, sir. See the picture? No, we're going to get an interview. <laughs> I am with Notre Dame linebacker. I am with Notre Dame linebacker Jalen Smith. Jalen, you were down by down by three with four minutes to go. What emotions were you feeling at that point? Um, it's really just to give it all. You know, um, Really, just to, to go out there and, and try to execute, you know, get one more stop. You know, we uh, we felt that the offense was going to go down there and score and uh, make it to where we had 38 points, and we just had to go out there and get one more stop. The option style offenses for you guys are officially over. It has to be kind of a relief. Why is it so difficult to, to defend that kind of offense, and how does it motivate you guys throughout the season? Um, it's it's difficult because on every play, you know, there's three options you know that the ball can go to so ultimately if one player mess, misses their assignment or misses their fit by a step you know it can be ruined and um you know they played it with to where they you know they wanted to get five yards of play and you know most of the time that happened but you know when the uh, when the time came and we needed to stop we were able to come through